Make it out alive. Evil shall not triumph. This year, one man rose above the rest and deserves to be called. My baby! Freedom's bravest agent. What do you think? Giant robots and man-eating animals? Do I need more close-ups? What is this? It's my video submission for the Bravest Agent Award. Bravest Agent? <laughs> the footage wasn't even real. It was based on actual events. Yeah, right. Like, when did you ever punch an alligator? So, I added some special effects, big deal. I do brave stuff all the time. Huh, <laughs> like? Like the time I went skiing with both hands tied behind my back? That wasn't for a mission. But I did it. And you broke your leg? How about the time I drove 90 miles an hour down the highway? <laughs> you were just going to get a smoothie. But I beat the train. That's not courage. That's stupidity. Courage isn't just about doing something dangerous. It's about doing the right thing, even if you are afraid. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So do you think I should add more explosions? No, I think you should stop making silly little movies and start working on the home robberies case. Huh? The case? The mission we're supposed to be working on? <sighs> Don't tell me you haven't read the file. Defrades, Chandler, conference room, now. Busted. All right, I want updates. Defrades, what have you got? Oh, uh, me. Yes, uh, well, sir, where do I even begin? Well, this mission, which I have been working on, is just so very... Uh... Come on, you haven't even read the file. <laughs> what? Kids everywhere are getting robbed, and you're too busy making your silly little movie to notice. Wait, kids are getting robbed? All over the place. Toy cars, piggy banks, jump ropes, yo-yos. This is serious. Pix, please tell me you have something. After complex analysis and comparison, I've taken the list of every stolen item on the police reports and found a common denominator. Huh? There is one toy that was stolen from every house. This. A monkey? Nanner, the happy monkey. Haven't you seen the commercials? He can clap, he can dance, and that's all he can do. He's Nanner, the happy monkey. From Swivel Incorporated. Ah! The Ryan, what's wrong? Hello? Ryan? <laughs> happy birthday! <gasps> <gasps> I heard it was somebody's birthday. You tried to keep the information classified, but birthdays are meant to be celebrated and not kept a secret. Right, Ryan? Oh, no. How long has he been like this? Uh, there it is, right there. Get rid of it. Hurry, get that clown out of here. We're losing him. It's okay, honey. There are no more clowns in the room, I promise. You are safe. Just take a deep breath. <sighs> Just give him a few minutes. So, he doesn't like clowns? Terrified of them, bless his heart. It all started at his five-year-old birthday party. For he's a jolly good fellow, which nobody can deny. Cakes for everybody! And then we have a very special guest. And he's been terrified of them ever since. I am not. 
It's okay, honey. Mom! Wow! <laughs> I can't believe this! Ryan DeFrades is afraid of clowns! Chandler? This is serious. I need my top agent on this case. But, sir, he's going to be around all kinds of toys. What if he comes face to face with another C-L-O-W-N? I know what that spells. If he freezes up again, it could blow the entire mission. I realize that, which is why we need your help, Mrs. DeFrades. Whoa, whoa, whoa! You've dealt with these episodes before. I have. And you can help him if he has another? Oh, absolutely. What? How am I supposed to win the Bravest Agent Award if my mom tags along? <laughs> Good luck. So someone is stealing a bunch of toy monkeys? Exactly. And we need to figure out who they are and where they're taking them. Great. How do we do it? With this. A teddy bear? Her name is Glare Bear, and she's an interactive mobile surveillance station. Like a secret camera? Sort of, but she can do this. Oh, my. Great. Now we have a cartwheeling teddy bear and a toy monkey. That's all we need for a trap. First, we copy the other robberies by setting up a child's room. Next, we bring in Glare Bear to give us a visual. Got it. Then, we bring in the bait. Excellent. Now all we have to do is wait for the thief. Are you all in position? Are these disguises really necessary? Yes. You're sure we have to hide in the bush? There aren't any spiders, Mom. Relax. You don't know that. Ooh. All right. Once the thief steals the monkey, you guys will sneak out and follow him to his hideout. Got it? Copy. Whoa, wait a minute. Did that just... We've got movement. Someone's already inside? <laughs> It's the monkey! Wait, what? The monkey is the thief! He's stealing stuff now! But... Someone must be controlling him! Yes! Yes, my little friends! <laughs> now bring it all home to Daddy! He's getting away! Follow him! Got him! Wait for me! Really? He's not going to clean this up? Mom! <laughs> Whoa! Someone's coming! Quick! <laughs> I think we found their hideout. A toy store? With a trap door! I wonder where it leads. I'm going to go find out. Wait, what about us? You won't fit. You're too big. Did she just call me fat? All right, I'm in. Yeah, but we're not. Hold on. Looks like there's an air vent at two o'clock. Got it! Oh, wow. What? We're going in the dark, creepy tunnel? Air vent. You don't suppose there are any spiders, do ya? Look, Mom, this is what being an agent is all about. And if you're not up for the challenge... I... Right. Hasta la vista, Mama. Hello, bravest agent. Uh-oh. Looks like it's time for a disguise. Whoa! Pix 
next to Ryan. Do you copy? Go for Ryan. I found some sort of monitoring system that is controlling the monkeys. Can you shut it down? Maybe. There's just one problem. Just give me a few minutes. Ew, gross. I see you, you little creeper. Don't even think about it. Mom? Ew. What are you doing here? I came to help you, but I thought... Oh, I'm still terrified of those little monsters. But I love you more than I'm afraid of them. And I want to be there in case you need me. Thanks, Mom. Is there one on my head? Yeah. Get it off. You've got to be kidding me. Yes, yes. Excellent, my little friends. Now go out and bring me some more. My plan is working perfectly, and soon my cupcake launcher will be fully loaded. <laughs> Almost there. Is that? <laughs> Freeze, you baking baboons! I'm okay. My purse! That's it! <laughs> you good? Yep. All right, here goes. Uh-oh. I hope nobody heard that. <laughs> All right, Pix, we're here. Um, I'm a little tied up at the moment. Looks like it's just you and me. Let's see what we're dealing with. Wow. Put me down, you ugly monkeys! Okay, let's just stay calm and come up with a plan. Freeze, you plundering primates! That's right, you abominable baboon bandits! You maniacal monkeys! You... Ryan Defrates. Oh no, it's a clown! Remember me? Your birthday party. I was young, ambitious. All I wanted to do was make children laugh. But then... Hey, you're scaring him, you big ugly clown. <laughs> Evil, horrible, nasty little children. They all deserve to have their toys stolen. And as for you, bring out the Crusher! Oh, what do I do? Pix! Uh, kind of busy. Come on, Deb, think. Think! Not now. Oh! <laughs> and now, Ryan the Traitors, prepare to... Oh, who do we have here? You are a mean clown. Oh, yes, the mother. I'm sorry, honey. Move her into position, boys. 
After all, ladies first. Uh, ready? Aim! Fire! How did you... I guess I realized I love you more than I'm afraid of clowns. Get them, boys! What do we do? We put an end to all this monkey business. <gasps> Strike! the clown is now safely behind bars. And the stolen toys are being returned to the children as we speak. I say that's cause for celebration. Cupcake? No thanks. I don't think I'll ever eat another cupcake as long as I live. I still don't understand what happened. I mean, you were terrified of clowns one minute and then you weren't. Are you kidding me? I was scared out of my mind. But it's like you said. Courage is doing the right thing, even when you are afraid. Now that is something to put in your Bravest Agent video. The Bravest Agent Award? You do know the entry deadline was last week. What? That's all right. As far as I'm concerned, you win the Bravest Son Award every year. Mom, 
Hey, I'm Jeremy, and this is my sister Kendra. And we are the writers of Ryan DeFrady's Secret Agent. In today's episode, Ryan faces an evil cupcake launching clown and learns that real courage is doing the right thing even when you're afraid. The Bible tells us that perfect love casts out fear. In today's episode, even though Deb was terrified of spiders, she went through a creepy air vent because she loved Ryan so much. And Ryan also overcame his fear of clowns to save his mom. Fire! Love is pretty powerful. Did you know that we can show God how much we love him by obeying him even when we are afraid? What do you mean? Okay, let's say everybody at school is making fun of someone. How do you think God would want you to treat that person? He'd probably want me to stick up for them. Right. But what if people start making fun of me too? They might. But if you obey God always, that's courage. In the Bible, there was a guy named Gideon. He was an ordinary man from an ordinary family. During this time, God's people were constantly being attacked by an evil army. One day, God spoke to Gideon. God wanted Gideon to lead his people in battle and defeat the evil army. Gideon was terrified, but he loved God and obeyed. The evil army was huge. They had 135,000 men. But Gideon's army was tiny and had only 300 men. Gideon was terrified, but he loved God more than he was afraid. During the night, Gideon's small army surrounded the massive evil army who was sleeping below. Suddenly, Gideon and his men held up torches and blew trumpets as loudly as they could, just as God had instructed them. The evil army woke up confused and began attacking each other. That night, God's people had a mighty victory. And it all happened because a man, small and incapable in his own eyes, dared to be courageous and follow God's leading. Exactly. Well, thanks for joining us today. We hope you come back next time on Ryan DeFrady's Secret Agent.